Chinese Air Force has been looking for a way to produce a counterpart to the fourth-generation fighter jets, used by NATO countries. The first idea about developing a Soviet-like fighter emerged in late 70s when Shenyang Factory combined a light fighter design of the Soviet MiG-19 with a British Rolls-Royce Spey 512 engine. This project was known as the J-11, but eventually failed. However this idea was resurrected two decades later. In the 1990s China signed an agreement with Russia, that allowed to build 200 Su-27SK aircraft from Russian-supplied kits. Production of the J-11 began in 1998. It made its maiden flight during the same year. However co-production of the basic J-11 was halted after around 100 aircraft were built. Some sources report that China violated agreement by installing indigenous electronics. It seems that Russia refused to supply kits for these aircraft to China. Later China began to produce indigenous versions of this aircraft on its own. The J-11 is a twin-engine, single-seat air superiority fighter, based on the Sukhoi Su-27's design. It has a Western reporting name Flanker B+. At the time of its introduction it was a fairly respectable fighter jet with Russian engines and weaponry. It was a noteworthy adversary to US-made aircraft, such as Lockheed Martin F-16 Fighting Falcon or Boeing F-18 Hornet. So far, there are 253 aircraft of various versions built and the production keeps on going. Produced in the Shenyang Aircraft Corporation in northern China, all of the Shenyang J-11 aircraft, including the J-11A, J-11B, J-11BS, J-11D, J-15, and J-16 versions are used solely by Chinese People's Liberation Army Air Force. It has never been exported. The first 100 Shenyang J-11 aircraft were fitted with Russian-made Lyulka Saturn AL-31 engines. However, the later versions, namely J-11B and J-16 use Chinese-built Washin WS-10A Taihang turbofans. Performance of the basic version of this aircraft, the Shenyang J-11, is very similar to Sukhoi Su-27, not only because of an almost identical design, but also because of the equipment. This version employs Russian equipment like NIIP Tykomarov N001V radar and armament including Gryazev Shipyanov GSH 30-130mm automatic cannon and Vimple NPO missiles. Variants J-11A is basically the same aircraft as J-11, the only difference being in improved equipment. This version is equipped with a different electronic flight instrument system. J-11B is an indigenous Chinese version, fitted with locally built radar, avionics, and weapons. Some sources report that up to 90% of components are indigenous. It also has some upgrades to the airframe. Existence of this aircraft was confirmed in 2007. J-11BS, a two-seat version of the J-11B. Essentially it is a combat-capable trainer aircraft, similar to the Russian Su-27UB. The first prototype was revealed in 2007. J-11D, an improved version of the J-11B, fitted with AESA radar and upgraded WS-10 engine. Other improvements include new cockpit, more radar absorbent materials, two additional hardpoints, in-flight refueling probe, new electronic warfare systems. J-15 is a carrier-borne version, equipped with Chinese equipment and weaponry. The aircraft is nicknamed the Flying Shark for a good reason, it is faster than its predecessor, with the top speed of 2,940 km per hour and higher service ceiling. J-16 is the latest model coming out of the Shenyang Aircraft Corporation. This is a two-seat multi-role fighter. It is an advanced version of J-11, based on the Su-30 and fitted with indigenous electronics. Also it has an added ground attack capability. Production of this warplane began in 2012. This aircraft has been in service with Chinese Air Force since 2013. By 2019 at least 128 J-16 fighters were operational.